But what to expect from stupid b****s? Sorry, blacks, but most of you are easy to manipulate ungo boingo bungo bongo. What is up, Yam Squad? Welcome to another video. In this video, I want to have somewhat of a debate because I've been watching a lot of clips from the H3, H3 podcast. There's a lot of racist language which are in their videos. Said, when I'm me saying, be like, I was at a party and said, she left. And they're like, oh, Ethan said, bitches. I had nothing to apologize for. But what to expect from stupid Sorry, blacks, but most of you are easy to manipulate ungo boingo bungo bongo. And of course, a lot of philic language. And I mean, there's there's a lot. As soon as I get with a fleshlight, you know, doll of a child, child, child. Obviously, ball guy. I think they're calling a file. I've been trying to attract a teenage girl my whole life so far. It hasn't worked. A teenage girl runs away with all type of vibe. <laughs> what do you think, Ella? Can we kidnap a teenage girl together? Uh, one of the striking videos which I saw out of this was the one where they're joking about, you know, the philia, the 14-year-old girl, or whatever he's joking about. Like, I don't know, is that allowed on YouTube? Is that, can you, can you joke about, like, little girls on YouTube? Or is that, because I, cause I'm, I just need to, I just need to find out if that's okay. You can't take me down. Someone makes a uh, compilation, yeah. it's like, here's Ethan saying, well, who's Faggot. The has just been around the block. Yeah, I love that I can just say <laughs> <"N> <laughs> faggot. Though. Yeah, like, I feel yeah, like you're, you're using a little liberally. <laughs> I love <laughs> saying N <laughs> faggot. It's so wonderful. Yeah. So now we, you're gonna get shit for it. Uh, goes to show that there's a lot of favoritism when it comes to YouTube. Uh, Susan's pet can do whatever he wants. He can say literally the same thing which Kanye said. Uh, but they're canceling Kanye West. Of course they're gonna do that. But Ethan, because he's a Jew. They're not going to cancel him. I mean, they're just going to slap him on the wrist and give him, of course, a lot of special treatment. Ethan Klein facing a lot of backlash right now. The host of the H3 podcast talking about Kanye West and all the controversy surrounding the anti-Semitism that he's been spewing lately. Talking about how Kanye had been hanging out with the likes of Candace Owens, then leading them to talk about her work with The Daily Wire and Ben Shapiro. At that part of the conversation, you had people saying, uh, Ethan went Death Con 3. Got another fucked up joke I wanted to say. Easy, Tiger. I was just gonna say, if there's Whoops. another Holocaust and people start oh, rounding boy. up uh. the Jews, this I just say, if we they start rounding up the Jews again, I hope Ben gets gassed first or last. Jesus. Yeah. Sorry, really not to um, What's up? not to speak. I'll the rail if I speak, Wednesday, I'm, you know, I'm Wednesday. Big trouble. Can I not say that? Yes. You can't. Oh my God. Yeah, I, what am I? Gonna, want today. What am I gonna? Get? I can't. Yeah, I'm, I'm not doing well. anything. I'm part of the, I'm getting gas too. With him almost instantly facing a ton of criticism and backlash, largely from conservatives and far right figures in particular, as well as others calling Ethan a scumbag, arguing that his channel should be deleted. People saying if Kanye deserves to be called out for his remarks, Ethan should as well. He also had others saying they don't agree with Ben Shapiro's views, but they think that the joke was too far. All of this even leading to a response from Shapiro himself saying, if there was another Holocaust, I would hope that Ethan and his family escaped, but maybe that's just me. And people try to crucify Drake for, I don't know if he was talking to a 17 year old girl or an 18 year old girl, but they wanted to, hey, it was H, you know what's so crazy? H3H3 made a video about this. Drake, 31 years old, hip hop mega superstar Drake. Millie Bobby Brown, the yeah. <laughs> 11. extremely famous 11 from Stranger, Stranger Things, Things. Uh, 14 years old. Um, it turns out that they are, I don't, not in a relate, not, um, they're no. friends. Yeah. And I find it interesting. Sp speaking as a 33 year old man, I'm close to Drake in age. How old is he? By 31. Now? Okay. Now, what purpose, what value would you get out of texting a 14 year old girl? I'm not really sure. Not much. I'm not really sure. I've, not I can't say but then when when she goes on to describe their relationship I not only raise one eyebrow I raise both of my eyebrows at first I heard about it because I think he invited her to a show and there was like a picture of them together and it was all cool right. it was clear that he's a fan of her yeah which you know who's she's not cool. like it's she, she's like such a badass on the show yes and she was a fan of him, so well, all good. Yeah. But then now it's like... <laughs> well, she did these interviews where she's getting into details of like, we text and we talk and he says that I miss you so much and I tell him I miss him yeah. and I imagine him, <laughs> him at home being like, no, shut up! <laughs> 
And it's funny, he's joking about grooming a 14-year-old girl. That shit is wild. I'm not even going to lie. Now that I think about this, right, H3H3 attacked Drake for that shit. Anybody else did something like that, made a joke like that, they'll be cancelled off the internet. As soon as I get ER with a fleshlight, you know, doll of a child, child, child. Obviously, ball guy. I think they're calling you I've been trying to attract a teenage girl my whole life so far. It hasn't worked. A teenage girl runs away wild type of vibe. What do you think, Eli? Can we kidnap a teenage girl together? And then also something which offends me and offends my people is the fact that Kanye is getting canceled for the things that he said. I understand that. But this guy's doing it on YouTube right now where he's spewing out racial slurs. Saying and a, and a reference. He, H3's a hypocrite oh, because he said on his podcast it's like dude i think there's there's a clear difference between saying and referencing it i said he said when i, I me saying be like i was at a party and she left and they're like oh ethan said said it i have nothing to apologize for but what to expect from stupid sorry blacks but most of you are easy to manipulate bingo boingo bingo bongo there's a lot of things which he has said and done which I just 100% disagree with. Him lying about Tate being a trafficker and everything. That is just wild. That's why I can't respect Ethan. And I never want to kick a man while he's down. To be 100% honest, I think that Tate should sue the balls off Ethan. Just because I think Ethan is a liar and a piece of shit. Ethan is just a piece of shit. There's no getting around it. I'm starting to realize who the snakes are when it comes to YouTube. He has no moral compass and he can't really stand on anything he says. I think he just does a lot of things now for clickbait. This is the thing which I said about cancel culture. It's it's just detrimental for everybody. Now, if anybody says anything, um, people are going to get canceled. And Ten. I'm just they? saying, they were every single one of them was black. Okay. If there's eight dudes on security <laughs> and they're all black, I think that's worth noting. I mean, they were all like 6'5", black yeah. dudes. Yeah, yeah, that's terrifying. Is a 6'5", black dude scary more than a 6'5", white dude? No. Is it supposed to? Um, You're a fucking If you guys want to make this a racially charged issue, that's between you and yourself. The viewer question for this video is, why isn't Ethan getting any repercussions for his racial slurs and his jokes? And doing all of this, doing it in front of camera. I And of course, blackface. There's, there's so much offensive things when it comes to this video. But apparently, YouTube does not deem that as offensive. So I, I just need to know, YouTube, where you guys are at. Because to be honest, is this the type of content which is allowed on YouTube? Or what what is happening? I'm, I'm very confused when it comes to that. So... If somebody on YouTube could enlighten me, I'll be very happy. Anyway, like, comment, and share when it comes to this. I told you guys, opening Pandora's box, canceling people wasn't good. People are trying to cancel Kanye West right now. The question is, should this guy be canceled also for the shit that he's doing? Yes, I guess it's okay to, to, to have this on YouTube and offend as many black people as you can. But anyway, I just want to say I watched all of this. And I got really, really offended by some of the things that Ethan said in his video. Uh, but anyway, if this if this is okay to have on YouTube, I understand. But then we should be able to make whatever jokes we want to make. I just, I just need it to be a little more consistent. Like, comment, and share if you want to see more videos like this. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.